This morning we're having some fun at the fair. At least Emily is. She's live in Seymour. Hi, Em. Rachel, it's a beautiful day out here to come check out the Outagamie County Fair. We are live from the fairgrounds this morning. I have a couple of 4-H club members here with me. We have Rachel and Alexa and their animals, Roxy and Pumpkin. So, Rachel, let's start with you. Tell me about the 4-H club you're with. I'm with the Buchanan Badgers 4-H club. And Roxy is a very unique rabbit. Tell us about her. Um, this is a giant Angora rabbit. They must have at least two inches of wool, and they must have a very nourished and full body on them. Wow. Tell me about the preparation it takes to get to this moment, because you're going to be showing her off today. So tell me about that. You must groom Angoras at least twice a week, but I like to groom mine every other day to make sure that the wool is still in good condition. And you want to make sure that the wool is not stained and that it's just, it looks nice. And that's what the judges are going to be looking for today? Yes. Wow. She's really cool. Is she comfortable sitting like that? Her neck is like back like, is she okay? Yes. <laughs> Giant Angoras are very friendly and mellow because they're handled so much. Oh. She is very unique. So cool to have her here. Alexa, tell me about Pumpkin and which 4-H club you're with. I'm from Fast Tractors 4-H club and this is my Ducle, my Millie Fleur Ducle Phantom Pumpkin. Oh my gosh, so cute. So tell me about the preparation you've had to have to get up to this point. Well, basically you have to clean them up as every animal, but you have to like clip their nails and their beak. And then you have to kind of like basically wash them up so they're not dirty or anything for the show. So. And you're showing tomorrow, right? Yeah, on Friday. Yeah, okay. tomorrow. So what's going to happen then when you go out there for the judges? How are you going to handle her? Um, you just handle them like this, basically with your fingers between their legs so they can't get free, you know. And then you basically just bring them up to the table and just show them. And the judge picks out the best chicken out of, like, so many birds. So, so cool. Yeah. Anything else you've been doing with your 4-H club, Alexa? Um, well, I also take pigs and sheep to the fair, too. So And rabbits. How cool. Well, best of luck to you. And then if someone wants to come check you out today, Rachel, and Roxy, what time are you going to be showing at? I'm going to be showing my rabbits at 8.30 Eight, this morning. 8.30. Okay, so you'll have to come check them out. Good luck to you, too. And look at everybody back there. Everybody's getting cleaned up and ready. It's been a busy morning already. The fair kicked off, you know, earlier this week on Tuesday. It goes until Sunday. There's a lot to see out here. You know, we featured food. We featured handcrafted beer. Coming up in the 8 o'clock hour, we're going to be featuring some games. I'm going to try my hand at some of that. So go to our website to learn more about how you can come out here, experience all the fun in Seymour. We'll send it back to you. What great weather for it. Thanks, Em.